I'm looking forward to seeing how Carly Taylor performs today. There's one of her teammates, number 15, on the left-hand side of the screen. That's uh, Nicola McDonald. I think we'll see Carly Taylor well looked after as they head towards the bottom of the climb. Kilometre zero, the flag is in. The stage is underway. There we can see on screen Sarah Gigante, the resplendent leader's jersey of the Santos Festival of Cycling Women's Road Race. A few more spectators coming down to the roadside for a look and they'd better get a hop on because the peloton is moving quickly. Today we are expecting some hot temperatures but they are just bystanders on the scenery today as they go past. Probably can smell a snag or two cooking on the barbecue down there. Sarah Roy on the right hand side. Ruby opens up. Sarah Roy is holding on to the wheel, but holding is all she can do because Ruby Rose McGannon is opening up the gap. The youngsters have emerged in this race. Three more points for Ruby Rose McGannon. Perfection. Into the town of Eldinga. This is Grace Brown, who is now off the front. She was one of the pre race favourites. This is a good move from the Bike Exchange to try, team to try and put. Team Garmin Australia on the back foot inside the last 20 kilometres. I'm really feeling the anticipation towards Wollonga. Imagine there'll be a lot of riders that when they get to the bottom, they'll be relieved that for them, they're sprinters and they can just go into tuning into race radio mode and hearing if one of their teammates is putting a big ride up the climb. This is Alana Forster now who is attacking. She's looking to get a head start before they hit the base of the claim, the climb. I like it. And this is where they'll be really taking back. And there it is. They've already taken her back, Alana Forster. And this is where it kicks up. This is the real start of the climb. You see the infrastructure there from this morning's uh, trek. Willunga time trial. Sarah Gigante, that is the sign. She sees the road go up and her morale goes up. She loves to climb. She loves to hurt. And here comes the pain. Working really nicely here out of the saddle. She's not just after the overall leader's jersey. She's not just after the stage win. I think she's even after the Strava segment. She's just about there. The Shimano, queen of the mountain, and she is crowned. She will win that competition. She will win on top of Wollonga Hill. She is the new queen of Wollonga. She takes the left hand up to the finish. Super Sarah for the second day in a row stamps her authority on the Santos Festival of Cycling. The Queen of Wollonga has been crowned. So, so cool that the women were able to race up Wollonga Hill for the first time. And oh my gosh, it might look like a one person race at the end, but that was the best teamwork ever. I thought yesterday was next level, but that was just incredible. I had literal bodyguards around me all day. We knew that the other teams wouldn't give it to us easily. So yeah, I think everyone was trying to catch us out, but we have such a strong team around me. Yeah, it was just crazy. That was so, so lovely.